it's that comfortable heat, that warmth that we can enjoy as we are a little bit warmer today than yesterday, all due to those southeast and south winds as we'll tap out at 80 degrees and eventually start to see the chance of those uh, showers later on this evening. Our winds a bit breezy, especially in Muskegon right now with wind gusts at 20 miles per hour. So if you are north of Muskegon, that's where our moderate beach hazard risk is as waves can build to two to three feet. So just be cautious if you head out uh, up there over along the lake shore. Overnight tonight, though, that sprinkle, that light shower, partly cloudy conditions, still a pretty decent evening with temperatures dipping back into the lower 60s. So there's what's left of that shower for tomorrow morning. We take a break before tomorrow afternoon. This is when we can see another chance for showers, maybe even a potential storm in there. Some models really hold them back on the west side, so we'll see what we can keep here at home. And we can't even have them lingering into overnight and early Wednesday. Wednesday morning. So all in all, from today until Wednesday, about a half an inch of rainfall at most. Many of you, I think, will get maybe a tenth of an inch to a quarter of an inch of rainfall. So there's not a whole lot there. We'll see what we can get out of this. Tomorrow, 80 degrees, 82 on Wednesday. Then another cold front comes through on Thursday, but that is really moisture starved. So there's not going to be much in the way of shower activity with that. We will see some breezy winds and then a temperature change behind it because take a look at Friday, only 74 degrees. We'll be in the lower and upper 70s to uh, start this upcoming weekend.